What's up guys? Yeah, we're gonna check out some Oz Wins videos today. And this one is called Scared of the Dark at Hoss Twins. From one of the, you know, Hoss Twins channel Ask Hoss Twins. So, he's looking for a minute there. I guess for a minute there. But anyway, before we check this video out, if you have not done so, make sure you all subscribe to this channel so that way I can provide more content for you guys. And make sure you guys go ahead and show some love to the Hoss Twins, man. Check out all the channels, man, all the, the fitness, the, the political channels, the eating videos, the relationships, or the vlogs, or whatever you can find. I'll put all the channels in the description box down below, so that way you all can go ahead and check them out. And one of these days, we're going to do a collaboration together, man. One of these days, man, we're going to do some sort of a business together. You know, I can maybe learn some stuff from the Hush Twins, man, as far as the business wise, business wise goes. I mean, I don't know about so much about comedians anyway, you know, because I'm not a comedian, you know. Yeah, I, I never was, and I never planned to. I always think of the business side, of course, just like they're doing as well. So, one of these days, man, I want to do exactly how they're doing it, but make it my own. So, one of these days, do a collaboration. So, now that we, you know, done flapping our gums, why don't we go ahead and, you know, check this video out. Hey, we got some new shows coming. We're going to Corpus Christi, Texas, New Orleans. We're going to Edmonton County, Calgary County, Spokane, Washington, Tacoma, Washington, Vancouver, Canada, and Irvine, Brown, San Diego. Yeah, we're coming back to California. Go to hogswinstore.com for tickets. What's up, everybody? How am I looking? Oh. Uh, yeah. Oh. Uh. Can't go too close to the camera. Tired of this email. Scared of the dark. You bitch. Hey man, this is bad. It's hard to man. What was the last video? Was that the Hard Twins TV? Yeah. Hey Hard Twins, my name is Dan. That's gotta be an alias. Dan? Dan. Where is your what are you, a lieutenant? <laughs> are you the Lieutenant Dan? <laughs> Is he gonna say his fucking legs are chopped off? Say no, that's man. Hey, all right, my name is Dan, and I'm from Gary, Indiana. Yup, this is Lieutenant Dan, man. I've had problems yes. where he's from, man. Come on, I remember correct, right? Lieutenant Dan is from Indiana. <laughs> I've had problems <laughs> with being scared of the dark since age five. I'm now 25 years old. Man. It might seem funny for my age, but it's been a problem for a long time. That means something real bad happened to him when he was five. In the dark. Yeah. And something some, real bad. Something seriously What's happened. Happen? Did you see that movie, Poltergeist or something? <laughs> that had me quite, um, I see the bed my mom and dad until I was like 13. My <laughs> dad, somebody scared him really, uh, really, really bad, bad in the I dark. I'm a long run, mom. <laughs> <laughs> After I watch that movie, Pope the Guys, man, I'll be down if I go to sleep with damn TV on. <laughs> Cutting that bitch off. I have lights <laughs> on, candle, flashlights, everything on. <laughs> when I tell friends or family, they laugh and tell me I'm too old. And you are, don't yeah, yeah. I mean, I just, I mean that from the bottom of my heart. Man. Kevin, come on. I don't baby. know if he's a dumbass. He just, you know, he's just kind of, you know. Kevin, I am not. That don't make him a dumbass. He's got a fuck. He's 45. He's got a little too old. He can't even sleep with the lights on. We gon' help him, though. He ain't a dumbass. He's just got a problem. What you call him, man? He got a problem. He got a problem. <laughs> what should I do? Need to help. Yeah, okay. You found the right people. Listen to Dr. Hodge. Look at his face. Now, I gotta warn you. Oh. Even though this information is professional, it's unlicensed. <laughs> but look at it. When I was a kid, I was scared of dark too. I didn't like my feet hanging off the edge of the bed. I was scared some monster was gonna drag my ass up in the bed and eat me or something. I was scared. I, said, I thought someone was gonna start licking my toes. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Ain't no monsters getting here. Now cut all the lights off and just sit down and listen. Yeah. 
When you hear a noise, try to determine what that noise is. Yeah. Right? It's just little 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 noises at night that you never got perfect understand what those making them damn noise. Yeah, so that night, man, sound travels like crazy, man. You can hit pin drop down the street. Yeah. I don't know if that's gonna that gonna cure it. It might help a little bit. I don't know. Then when you about to have a heart attack, I don't gonna help that much. Like, <laughs> you just turn on all the lights. <laughs> And yeah, you find the darkest one, and then... Yeah, then do it know. again. You know, yeah. work up to 10 minutes. Then 15 minutes, work up help. to 30 seconds. This dude's gonna have a heart attack in the night. Might help a little bit. Man. Just build up. Before oh. you know it, you can be able to sit in the dark for 10 minutes. Yeah. And then you're like, what am I scared of? Man, I'm yeah. all day, I'm like... Then after you do all that, now you can go start going to uh, some surroundings you're not familiar with. Now, go into a busy city like New York City and walk down a dark black alley. Uh, you uh, yeah, you're going to get him killed. Uh, uh, and uh, you're going to see. Uh, ain't nothing to be afraid of, man. Uh, but uh, you got to take baby steps, man. Yeah. Take baby steps. I, I would disagree with that. Uh, uh, right out the middle of Depending on where you live at. Yeah, everybody's going to do nobody no good. Especially in the city. Everybody's going to get off uh, each other. Uh, they just got over. Yeah. Kind of like pissing in the bed when you're a little kid. Just as get older. older. As you get older, you just stop pissing on yourself. Just start taking baby steps, man. Just like my brother told you, man. Start off with 30 seconds, work up to a minute, then two, yeah. then three. Before you know it, you're going to be up to an hour. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Please make God back. Oh! Oh, wait a minute. Oh, demon licking my ass. <laughs> what the hell? Oh, I'm licking my balls. Crack yeah. gonna have that kid uh, terrified just by watching uh, Keith doing the demon thing again. What's up, man? Man, what's that smell? <laughs> you nasty mother. What's up, everybody? How am I looking? But 
Um, you know, I would say, first off, stop watching those, uh, <laughs> stop watching those horror movies. All them paranormal activity movies, all the ghost adventures, all the ghost hunters. Stop watching all that shit and then see what happens. Because I have a feeling, and I'm 24, I'll be 25 in November, right? And I ain't scared of nothing. And I, I can watch, like, uh, what you call it? Uh, I've been watching the first 48. It's like a little homicide investigate where people do, like, or uh, detectives, they do, you know, cases of homicide investigations and shit. I love that show. And, and I mean, and I don't, you know, I don't have nightmares of that. Or, and I used to watch, you know, Ghost Adventures and Ghost Hunters, you know, ever since I was like maybe 11 years old. And, and you know, I, I was scared for a minute there because, you know, I had a, a family member that passed away that I know of. And, you know, seeing that, he, going through that while seeing Ghost Adventures, it kind of traumatized me a little bit. But eventually I, I stopped watching it. And then, you know, I was not afraid of the dark anymore. You know what I mean? <laughs> I would say, to me, one of two things, right? So I'm watching those, the first one, definitely, which I think that's a problem is, you stop watching all them horror movies, all, this, all the paranormal activity movies, or TV shows, whatever it is, all the, cra all the, the scary, quote, quote, scary reality shows or movies, you stop watching that. Okay, another thing that, that he can do is he can listen to like music, right? He can listen to music and listen to music, you know, he can listen to certain things that keeps, keeps him positive, you know, whether it's rap or, 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 or reggae or whatever. I have a feeling this dude is in India and he probably listens to rap and shit. I might be wrong, but, um, you know, that, that would be the, those two things, you know, and then you sleep. You sleep through it, you know, sometimes, you know, or better yet, instead of listening to rap and all that crazy shit, you listen to, like, meditation music on your headphones, right? And that shit puts you to sleep real fucking quick. So, you know, I have a feeling that first one that I just did, that I just gave out, I have a feeling that might, that, that could definitely work. Because, you know, it, it catches up to the people, you know, even, like, when you were, like, small, when you're a small child, right, and when you see, like, certain shit that kind of, like, traumatizes you for a little bit, and then you can't sleep for, like, a like few weeks or months or years because of what you saw on TV, I mean, that can, that can haunt, that can, uh, I think that can catch up to you, you know, and another thing is that that dude, that dude sounds like he's coming, you know, he's living around with, like, an, uh, like in one of those creepy, crazy street areas, you know, all the gang member, all the the gang related and, and and drug dealers and all that shit. He might be getting, you know, he he might be around in that area. I I don't know. I don't know what's the fact. I mean, I might be wrong, but you know, at twenty five years old, I mean, you scared you you're afraid of the dark. Uh, sounds like to me, you got issues, man, because something something really really bad happened to something must have really really. Happen to you that bad to the point where you're afraid of dark. Now, either you saw a, a, a spirit, or, a, which is a ghost, or you saw, you know, or, or somebody was trying to jump on you, or whatever it is. Something really bad had to happen for this man for him to be terrified. Because I'm 24 years old. There ain't no way hell I'm terrified of nothing. Well, I can't say that. But I'm definitely not afraid of, of the dark. Shit, I... I'll be uh, waking up in the middle of the night taking a piss while I'm in the dark. So, I mean, you know, uh, you know, so as far as, you know, what they say, you know, as far as they like, just turn on the lights and then, you know, work your way up to eventually like, turning them on little by little, you know, all that shit that they said, I agree to a certain extent, but obviously, obviously, uh, you know, start walking around little by little throughout the night outside of your house. Uh, or around the, the city area, uh, I think that's a little bit dangerous. That's just my opinion, though. That's a little dangerous. And, you know, you know, throughout the day, you walking around throughout the day, too, it can be dangerous, too. But, you know, it, I, I would say, like I said, those two things. Either stop watching those crazy-ass those crazy, -ass, those crazy -ass movies and TV shows or listen to some meditation music because I find it to, to be helpful with, you know, 
I know sometimes when I struggle to fall asleep, I always listen to like meditation music. So all the sleep and meditation it helps you clear your mind sometimes and shit. So, you know, that's my thing. So what you know, what else what else you guys think you can do in this situation? Let me know in the comments below. Also, are are any of you afraid of the dark? Let me know in the comment section down below and tell us why. And if you enjoyed this video, you can do me a solid favor and smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and smash that share button. And remember, don't forget to click that notification bell on so that way you don't miss any videos that are upload. Alright guys, well, at the end of the day, it's just advice. Just like the Hashim once said, you know, you can do anything the fuck you want to do. Peace out.